everyone it's your girl Leia I'm coming to you today with a review on this Icy Beauty Bob wig um, it's a 10 inch it's Malaysian and it's 150 percent density and I'm trying to think what else that's it y'all that's it but yeah I bought this with my own money um, so it this is a real review this is uncut this is what they sent me and it's very nice hair don't get me wrong it's very nice hair I will say when they sent me the bob I did not like the way it was cut. I didn't like the way it looked. I was not even going to use it. Like, and I've seen people review this bob. Theirs looked more blunt cut when they got it. I had to cut this hair. So luckily I do know how to cut hair. But I feel like even somebody who don't know how to cut hair can cut this bob. It's, it's, I mean, it already comes short. It's easy. You just kind of put it on the mannequin, cut to your like and put it on your head, frame your face, and that's that. But this hair is nice. Like I love it. I've got so many compliments on it when I'm out on the street. Um, everybody's loving this bob on me. Everybody's like, whoa, Leia, like, hold up, you look good. I'm like, thank you. But yeah, so I'm going to include clips on how this hair looked when I first got it. I might include a clip on how it looked when I first put it on. It was a hot mess, y'all. I was like, oh, no, nah, like, what is this? Um, and I, you know, I'll include how the, it looked coming out straight out the box and just like all of those details. Um, but before I do that, I will just let y'all know, like I said, it's been a week and a half. I haven't really, I haven't gotten any shedding from this wig whatsoever. No shedding. I did bleach the knots. Um, so maybe you want to see a little bit up close. I did bleach the knots. Like I said, I did cut it. Um, it's, it just seems really nice to me. It's really nice and full. Now for me, I got the average size wig. This is my first time buying a wig. I usually make all my wigs, but this time I was like, hmm, let me just try to buy a wig that's already made. You know, I have a son and he doesn't uh, give me a lot of time in order to, you know, do what I needed to do and to make my wigs like how I used to make my wigs anymore. So, you know, it's been really hard for me. I got the average size. So it was like 22.5 centimeters um, around your head. Too big for me. I should have got a small, but I, sewed in a strap um so they actually send you one of the black straps with the wig which is nice they send you mink lashes a strap with the wig and just some other stuff so i sewed in the strap from the tabs so from the side tabs i sewed from like here to here and that works like it made my wig tight it has combs in it so i take the comb and i push it up here push it up here and it has a comb in the back and i'll show you the back So I, it's a comb in the back too. I pushed that up in my nape. I don't have any glue on it. Um, I did buy the Gots to Be glue, but I haven't been, I haven't had to use it. And honestly, I don't like gluing down my wig, so it's perfect for me. The fact that I was able to um, sew that strap on and you know just get going. So let's get into it. And I hope you love this review. So this is the cute box that it came in. It is cute on the inside and the outside. I was so happy with the packaging like they couldn't have done better and as you can see the wig came in this plastic bag it came with the specs Malaysian hair 150% density um, there are combs three combs at the top um, one comb in the back these are the knots as you can see they are not bleached so I definitely had to bleach those close up this is how the wig looked when I put it on fresh out the box excuse the cap underneath the wig was definitely big um, I should have got a smaller size as I said before and I did not like the length I did not like the length of it I ordered a 10 inch I should order an 8 inch so I definitely had to cut that now this is the wig after it was washed cut the elastic strap was sewed in and it's on my head and of course the knots were bleached so yeah i'm loving the wig i'm loving the cut i'm loving everything so i definitely i probably cut off about two inches i would say i'm not too sure but i probably cut off about two to three inches i made it basically into like a blunish cut in a sense natural looking bob everyone thinks it's my real hair Anyone I go on, they're like, oh, is that your real hair? Like, you cut your hair? I'm like, no, I didn't cut my hair. It's just a wig. 
but the hair is very nice there is no tangling I haven't have really had any issues so I hope that y'all enjoyed that review. I hope that y'all got all y'all questions answered. If you have more questions, you can leave them in my comment box below. Please like and subscribe. And let me know if y'all want to see more. I have so many wigs that I make. I have so much hair in my closet. Like, I can do more reviews. And I'll also do some more things to talk about some different topics other than just hair. But I love hair. I have a passion for it. Um, but like I said, just with my son, I haven't really been able to get to it more, but maybe this will help me, you know, talk about it a little bit more because I don't have my clients like I used to do when I lived down in Georgia. I actually live up in Merlin now. So yeah, I hope y'all enjoy and have a good day. Bye.